Here's another new model from the 2017 Hot Wheels F case. It's the Isle Driver, and it is from the Ride On series. And this one does include the minifigure. So that's pretty cool. I don't think I've seen one yet, uh, at least in the main lines, that uh, comes with a minifigure. Um, so this is kind of similar to your Legos, although this guy is a lot taller than your normal Lego figure would be. Uh, his hands are built sort of like Lego figures to where they will hold on to this. So I guess this is probably a standard size rail uh, that he's holding on to on this shopping cart. But uh, this one is from the Ride On si series, so it is designed uh, to let you have minifigures on them. And uh, you might notice from this angle, and I guess if I turn it up you can see it as well, there's a couple of pegs there. Unfortunately, the minifigure that comes with this does not have the holes in the bottom of his feet to fit that. Um, but some of your other minifigures like Legos may be able to uh, fit on those pegs. Possibly you could even get a block on there. I'm not sure if there's enough room or not. Uh, maybe you could get a block on there and uh, you could stack some, some building bricks up inside there and that would open up a whole world of possibilities for what you could do if that were the case but I haven't tried it yet uh, so I'm not sure uh, if we look in we'll zoom in on the side let you see that so there's the Isle Driver logo uh, four ride-ons I believe that says I don't know if I can zoom in close enough to see that I still can't Still can't read what it says, uh, but there's a Hot Wheels logo right below that. That's pretty clear. The wheels. This one has the OH5 wheels outlined in yellow. Uh, the base. It's a plastic base. So this is silver plastic on the base. The top part, the cart itself, is metal. So you've got metal cart and a plastic base there. So here's the view from the front. Uh, you can take him around and move him to the front there. His feet don't quit or fit don't fit quite as well on that little peg at the front. But let's see these arms. The arms are not adjustable. Arms don't move, so it's kind of hard to change his position there unless you want to do something like that. So if you're going to do some planks on the front of a shopping cart, I wouldn't recommend that unless you've got something to weight it down in the back, but uh, this guy's pretty light, so he can handle doing that. So you've got all kinds of options as uh, far as how you want to do that. Uh, he can grab onto the side rail. He can ride inside. So we've got some options. This is a fun one. Kids are going to love this. There's lots of things you can do. But this will be fun to go down the track with as well. So uh, it does say track stars there on the card. So this one's supposed to uh, do pretty well on the track. And with your minifigure there, that will make for some interesting, interesting rides down the different track sets that are out. There's the view from the other side. So, uh, once again, I'm going to put them on the back. And you will notice, I didn't point this out before, there's like a little step right there for him to stand on. So it fits perfectly uh, with his legs there as he goes. The little yellow guy, has got a, looks like a, kind of a motorcycle helmet, stunt helmet on right there. So, there you go, closer look at him. All right, that is the 2017 new model Isle Driver. Thanks for watching.